In this lesson, we're going to learn two components are very important in React Native, and those are save view and scroll view. Imagine that we have here a text, text called hero dev. If we see here, we here can see that the hero dev text at the top of Android device. But if we see here in iOS, the hero dev text is at the top. That touch bar or this notch is hiding it. How to solve this problem in iOS? We have a component called save area view. Let's import it from React Native, save area view. And let's replace our view with save area view. And press save. When we press save, look what's happening. The hero dev text in the save view now. The, those notch is not affected it or hiding it. And we can see our text here. And that's, that's save area view. It's for iOS to, to have this save view and make our content didn't touch the, the, this part, the iOS part. Our second component here called scroll view. Imagine that we have multiple texts, for example, but let's first get give him some font size, font size of, for example, 60, or let's make it 100. Wow, that's very big. Imagine that we have multiple ones to fill the screen. Now we have here one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, nine texts. But here we, we can't see one, two, three, four, five, six. We cannot see all of them. We just have one, just seven of them. There is another two. And here in Android, we just have a three of them. So how to make this view scrollable? I want to scroll down and scroll to the top. So we have another component called scroll view. Scroll view. We have to import it from React Native and we have to wrap our content with it. Scroll view. And let's press save. Now with this scroll view, we can scroll to the down and to the top. Look here, here in iOS and here in Android. Look. Great, isn't it? But if we look here, we will notice an ugly indicator at the right here. We want to hide it. So we have to make it to have show this, to add this property, show vertical scroll indicator and to make it false. False. Now we cannot see it anymore. That's indicator at the right. And here in Android, we cannot see it. What if we want to style our content of this scroll view? We have a property called content, container styling. We can give it a background color of red. Look, we can, what if we want to leave some space at the bottom here? We can add some padding button here. Padding button, for example, 50. Now, we have a 50, 50 pixels at the down here. We can make it 200. Now we have a space of 200 pixels down here. 